So, the US have recently killed a certain important person in the Iranian government. And that has led to fears arising that a war with Iran is very possible. I figured I'd play some TF2, get some, you know, last minute practice in. Well, if we get drafted, really, you know, get some last minute practice, play some TF2. So the US have killed someone called Qasem Soleimani. Uh, I think that's how you pronounce it, but for the purposes of this, we're just going to call him Mr. Salami because that's much easier for my Western mind to, to comprehend. <laughs> As a TF2 member, TF2 SP member. Join TF2 SP today. TF2 ship posting. We're a Facebook group where you can shit post about TF2. Woo! Oh, that was amazing. Ah oh, shit. <laughs> I was gonna say that that jumping on that um good old good old shipping crate really saved my life. That's a tactic I'm gonna have to implement when I'm in when I'm sent to Iran. But yeah, this is just a little meme and an excuse to play TF2 for a video where I can just say I'm training for my in in inevitable draft against in the war against Iran, even though I'm from the UK, not America. That pyro was majestic as frick, really. So here we are, we're on uh, whatever this map is, Metalworks. Not gonna lie, I forgot this map existed, but we're wearing a nice soldier uniform to get into, you know, the spirit of war. <laughs> war is not a thing that should be glorified. It's It's not a good thing. But when the opportunity arises to make a, a video, when you're kind of low on ideas, I'm going to take it. CWM1 is as strong as ever. He picked up my shotgun. Bless him. Now I do live in the great United Kingdom, so there is a chance that we won't be drafted into war. However, the US is our staunch ally, and as allies we support one another in many things, including conflict. That's how World War One began, and uh, that's what made World War Two so devastating. But we can hope that war doesn't break out against the two, because that would be terrifying. War is as destructive now as it has ever been. World War Two was far worse than World War One because of the advancements in killing, and World War One was far worse than the previous wars before that because of the improved ways of killing your fellow man. I just want to play TF2, to be honest with you. It's a great game. One of my favourites. And while it hasn't received an update in far too long, it's still a fun game. Still got a thriving community. Sure, there's been a slight hacker invasion in recent years. Recent months, should I say. But it's still a fun game, and I'm dead. Oh, bloody hell, I just got shredded by that heavy. Fucking hell. Chill out, my guy. Damn. Oh, whoever just extinguished me. Big up. Oh, what? It uh, seems that round of training wasn't successful. Let's see if I can live. Don't point that thing at me! No. Here we are, we're on round two. Hopefully we can turn it around. I'm, I do not know because both teams are very like, evenly matched. We both got like two medics and some good players on our teams. I'm not doing too well but I'm with my fellow Team Fortress 2 shitposting member so that's pretty cool. Oh my, thank you for this. Or not. Oh, fucking hell. Ooh, okay. Holy shit. Note to self. Stay away from men with flamethrowers. I'm flamethrower main, main in this game, but I don't think WM1 is going to be successful on the battlefield as it is here. Personally, I mean, it could be. If I just have a phlogistonator and just set people alight and get crits, then maybe it'll be successful in real life. Yeah, maybe we could demo night in real life, actually, because Scotland is very close to England. I might be able to pass as a Scot Scottish man for the recruitment process. I, I can't do a good Scottish accent, but I can fluff it for 
the interviews, p perhaps. That was my impression of a Scott. That this is why they want to leave us. <laughs> Look at this piece of art I got commissioned. It's by someone called McFlary on Twitter. And it's fucking sick. It looks like my military training isn't going too well. Something that's more my speed. Well! Hell yeah. Or should I say, well yeah? <coughs> that's comedy right there guys. If, if I don't have a million subscribers after making that joke. Let's go gamers. It's time. We gotta defend these points with our lives. Okay? We're training to fight against Iran if that war comes into fruition. We can hope it doesn't. But if it does, we'll be ready because we'll have played TF2. <laughs> the most realistic depiction of warfare I think ever made. It's, it's a shock that the US forces currently aren't using this game to train their armed forces. Don't see me scout, don't see me, don't see me. Nice. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> hey, mate. Okay. F fair enough. God, I'm I'm really glad that when we go to war with our people like XXX Halo Reach gonna XXX. You know, I'm glad, I'm glad they'll be fighting with us. Easy game. Easy. TF2 has also prepared us for what to do in the event we win a battle. In 30 we taunt. Hell yeah. I wonder if they'll let us wear nice hats while we're battling. You can only hope. I just want to wear my loadouts, bro. Is that too much to ask? I'm just going to fucking leap over this train. No worries about it. <gasps> Boom. <clears throat> oh my, I just got yeeted back. Fucking hell, I'm about to die. Where does this take us? I've only played the CTF it. Oh. Okay. Did not know that was a featuring uh, in um, Capture Point. But I'm glad it is. Underwater warfare time, boys. Get him. Come on. Oh god. That concludes my training. Go forth. <laughs> Train yourself in the realistic ways of TF2. And I shall see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Have a great day. Peace. Hey, oh, uh, uh, I've been up for like two hours. Two hours. Yo, bitch can food took a few showers. Few showers. I don't buy my just money dance. Yeah. That wristwatch costs a hundred grand.